Oh my god. Well. That's one way to celebrate doing this crazy approach, isn't it? Oh yeah, Black Marble and Stargazer are great. I use Stargazer for, well, the stars. Which I think looks incredible. Name the best scenery I should buy. I think the best scenery in The Sim is either this scenery, Orbex Innsbruck, or um, I, oh, I'm going way slow here. Um, or I love Orbex in, uh, I just said Orbex Innsbruck. Um, I can't speak. Flight Beam, San Francisco, that's the one. Flight Beam, San Francisco, Fly Tampa, Amsterdam as well. Those are my top three. Yeah, those are my top three sceneries. Don't forget, folks, again, tomorrow's Tour Tuesday as well. We're back to a normal Tour Tuesday tomorrow. Um, so we're going to be... Um, we're going to be flying out of Anchorage to Juno. If you've not seen the Juno approach before, it is sublime. Uh, and then we're going to head down to Seattle afterwards. So we've got two flights tomorrow for the tour. Legs number 53 and legs number 54. Uh, there's no stream Wednesday because I am out. Uh, I'm off to see the 1975. I'm off to a gig. Um, then Thursday, we're going to do some subscriber flights, probably in the Airbus because we've not flown the FS Labs for over a week now. Uh, and then Friday, we're going to have a trucking day. So Euro Truck Sim 2 on Friday. So no flying on Friday. And then Saturday, of course, is a certain Mr. Chewbacca's 25th birthday. And we're going to be doing a Lego build for a long haul. So what we do, if you've not visited one of those streams before, is we set up a long haul flight. And then when we get into cruise, um, I get a Lego set and I point my camera down and we build the Lego. Um, so we're going to be building the red london bus and then we're going to be building the red london bus right i'm going to go into heading select let's put some lights on um so yeah so that's what we're going to be doing on saturday we're going to set up a, a long haul flight yet and then um we will, um, sorry, I'm just trying to work out what the hell I'm doing here. <laughs> this is very interesting. Um, yeah, we'll set up a long haul flight and then we'll get into cruise and we'll um, get building a Lego build. Hopefully we'll finish it during that flight. If we don't, it's no problem. Um, we'll, uh, we'll finish it off another time. Alfred, hello. Happy landings. Thank you, Roy. See good. Good afternoon. You thought I was 30? No. That's why 94's at the end of my name. It was the year I was born. <laughs> it's not just a random year. I should definitely have this on. I can't see anything that I'm doing right now. Oh, that's the one I'm looking for, props. Right, so we've got the localizer. Oh my god, where the hell is it putting me? <laughs> I can't see anything. Right, well this is going to be interesting. Gareth, hello, how are we doing? Uh, F01703, I don't know at the moment what air airport we're going to be landing into. Yeah, this definitely doesn't seem right. I do not like the look of this. The localizer is off compared to the LNAV. Happens in every aircraft. If you say so. I think the Q&H isn't set yet. No, I was going to set it now, actually, just as we we're about to reach the glide. So it's 1017. Yeah, there we go. Right, and there's glide as well. Okay, good, good. Uh, I don't like this. Is it a thunderstorm? No, it's just overcast, but hopefully we'll be able to see things through. Tomersal with six months. Thank you, Tomersal. Welcome back. Half a year with Twitch Prime. Thank you, my dudes. 2,500, lol. Holy crap, look at that. Welcome back. Thank you, mate. Six months. Keep it up. I will do, mate. Thank you very, 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 very much. Right, I'm going to start slowing down. All right, 
I know, I know, I know. Thank you, Tom. Welcome back. Right, I'm going to mute alerts. Actually, I'm going to mute alerts now, guys, because I kind of need to concentrate and not screw this one up. So I'm going to mute the alerts early, okay? How far out are we? Oh, my God. Hello. There we go. Right. Runway. Ooh, it's crunch time now. <sighs> Opens clip page. Yeah, get ready. Some of the... Uh, we've still not got the autogen loading in, which is annoying. We had that earlier on. You're going to see it gradually load in, but hey-ho. Yeah, we are doing the circle to land, which I've never done in this aircraft before, and I've never done at night. So, means. Right, flat five. Still haven't done those. I keep forgetting them today. I don't know why. Is this right? Because that's saying we're 11.3 DME out from from there. I don't know if that's correct. Maybe it is. Sorry about the slow loading auto gen. You can see it coming in gradually. There we go. That's looking a bit better now. Go into VS. Are we high here? Sorry, I'm slow, so we've got time. It's still saying I'm 9.9 .9 DM. I guess that's correct. No, I guess that's okay. Right, so the heading that we want is 230. So we're going to arm that. I've lost my speed because I'm not concentrating. Oh my god. <laughs> This is not going to go well, surely. Oh, a shallower descent. Okay, cool, that's fine. Right, what was the thing again? 4.2. Yeah, 4.2, 230. Okay. Oh, my God. And I need out selling. I'm scared. 1,000 to level is checked. Yeah, we're actually really low for where we need to be. Can I not just go in on that runway, please? Please. Please. <laughs> right. I'm hovering over heading select. You could. There is almost no... I know, it's variable at two knots, but everybody's being mean to me and saying I have to do this approach. It looks absolutely stunning, though, doesn't it? Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah, we are really doing the circle to land. I know. If I cock it up once, we're going around, and then I'm going to do the 2-6 approach. Right, there's 4.5... 4.4, 4.3, 4 4.2. So, heading select, 230. I haven't even got anything on here to tell me if I'm going in the right direction. Oh my god. <laughs> Why am I doing this? Right, I'm going to drop the gear and everything now. I know that's hella early, but I'm doing it now because I am. And it wants us to be 3,700 here. It's going to dip the nose down, but that's okay. Oh my god. How am I supposed to do this, guys? How in the world am I supposed to do this? Right, let's just watch the power now, because it's going to level out at 3,700. And then you're supposed to take a right turn, 264. 
However, I don't know when you're... That's the problem, is I don't know when you're supposed to take that turn. 1,000. He's checked. I need to get away from that, don't I? What's the speed here, Chewy? I've probably done it early, but YOLO. <laughs> Thank you, John Fezzer fanboy. <laughs> right, I'm hella slow, but we got the altitude right. Let's watch the speed. And then we need to wait now, apparently, until we're 3.5 DME. I think I'm too close. Uh, sorry, I think I'm, I'm not... Uh, I think I'm not close enough here. Let's just watch that speed. So it's saying we need to be... Well, it's saying we need to be 3.5 DME. That's quite far out, actually, isn't it? Because at the moment, we're 2 DME out. Right. Autopilot's coming out. Here we go. This is the crunch moment now. This is the moment you have all been waiting for. There's an autosave. So if I screw this whole thing up, I can just go back to that. Ah, there's the church. Aren't you supposed to do it when you're above the church? out well has it it's a speechy why am I easing the turn because I was an idiot speed it's fine caught it That's why I'm easing the turn, apparently. Speed, watch it. Okay. Um, I'll take it. That's why I was easing the turn. <laughs> I overshot it. Shut up. I did the approach. Stop moaning. Love you guys. That approach is for all the haters out there who said I couldn't do it. So speed again, Chewie. Early on the flare, my bad. Ten. Sort out the centre line a little bit and we're good. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Somehow, on first attempt, welcome to Innsbruck. Is that where I turn off? Yes, that is where I turn off. Woohoo! That was fun! I told you it's easy. It's, I have to say, that approach is a lot easier in the dash than it is in other aircraft. 
I think it may be because I was so slow. I think it, oops, I think it was maybe because I was so slow. That was bloody brilliant. Lasiris, thank you for eight months, buddy. Welcome back. Thank you also for all the follows that are coming through today, guys. I know they don't pop up on the screen, but I do still see them. So thank you, folks. Lasiris, eight months in a row. Welcome back. Thank you, bud. Thank. Thank. Thank, thank, thank. Right, what else do I need to clean up? Well, yeah, that went surprisingly better than I thought it would, actually. I don't quite know how, but it was all right, wasn't it? I'm not going to do the return trip back to Vienna. I'm going to I'm going to stop after here, Madrisco, for today. Chewie's worn out after that. But I'll be back again tomorrow. Even in the Airbus, it's easy. Well, it may be easy for those of you who are blessed to be better pilots than me. But for a Wookiee who knows that he's streaming it in front of 500 odd people. It may be, it's a little bit more difficult. Right, we've not missed the stand this time like we did earlier in Twinsbrook. <laughs> See you later, Madrisco. Thank you, mate. For my first attempt in the dash... Oh, my God. My parking. Where the hell am I going? Yeah, for my first attempt in the dash and for nighttime landing, I'll t I I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. I did overshoot it. I shouldn't have um, rolled out of the bank when I did quite like that. I felt like the initial turn, that, that's the reason why I rolled out, because I just felt like the, the initial turn, I was like, oh God, I feel like I'm, if I continue on that bank angle, I'm going to go into something. I'm going to go into the terrain or something like that. So that's why I rolled out from the bank and then continued it on, but I shouldn't have done it. I shouldn't have made, I should have just reduced the bank, not completely rolled out, I guess. Because, uh, you know, I overshot it slightly. But hey, you know, one of those things, I'll remember that for next time. I will remember that for next time. Whew. That was fun. Um, yeah, that's all fine. For the GPU, actually. I don't do this in any sort of good order whatsoever. I know. Good flow, but... Oh, nice, Toby. Yeah, no, we, we've had some fun hops today. Yeah, we've done. We departed Vienna, which was nice. It was cold, but it was good there. And then uh, we just. Uh, we did uh, the Arnav approach for runway 26 into Innsbruck, uh, and we messed up the, the descent profile, um, causing me to do like basically just a visual approach which was good fun uh, then we went into frankfurt had nice weather conditions there had a nice quick easy approach and now we've just done the uh, visual circle to land for runway 08 at night so uh yeah all right is the gpu there it is there so all round it's been bloody good fun i think near the apu spool down there And there you go, ladies and gents. There you go.